friends, it's Nia. Welcome to Life with Nia. I'm so mad at myself, y'all. I'm so mad at myself. I did not check the mail yesterday. And I checked it late today because the only thing I thought was in there was my Simply Gilded sub box, and so I wasn't impressed for that. I wasn't impressed enough to go. Like, the mailman came at like 8 o'clock last night. So I wasn't impressed enough to go out there in the dark and walk down to the mailbox and get my mail. Like, I did not have tracking for this. So I did not know it was there. Had I known it was there, I would have went and checked. Because my whole life has been hinging on this package. From Isisella Jewels. And when I tell you my whole life, yes, I'm being extra and exaggerating, but really, because this is the final piece, almost, to my 2022 planner lineup. It's one of the most important pieces. I'm still trying to figure out what I want to do for business social media, but this is one of the most important pieces to my lineup for 2022 because inside of here is a planner that I will use to journal every morning. Start my day off right. So let's get into the um, last quarter of 2021, the sub box from Isis Ella Jewels. Um, if you are not familiar, check her out one of my favorite shops. I use her dolls frequently um, in my planner layouts. Okay, we got stuff on the out. Okay, so. Here is what we have. So we have a pin. And it is a metal pen. It's got um, like a, hmm, maybe like a sage green color. And it's got crystals on it. It's got Isis Ella Jewels engraved there. Silver hardware. I just happen to have an Isis Ella Jewels sticky notes. These are not my favorite pens. I always feel like they are loose for lack of a better term Let's see if I can get this off of here um they typically are gel ink similar to simply gilded so I like how they write it just always feels like there's a little give to it that is not my favorite but I love like the weight of it it's a, always a heavier on the heavier side the um you can replace the ink and so that's always nice because you can continue to use the same pen so we have a pen and then we have a either a charm or a necklace this is the rooted lily which is i think it's like a bookmark a page page marker this is one of my favorites this probably is my favorite, um, Lily, which is the rooted one. And this looks like it clips onto the page, so you've got yourself like a page marker. So we'll check that out in just a second. Okay, so then we have... So then we have um, these are pockets. So this one says center yourself. And this one says deeply rooted in my faith. And this one says everything is in divine order. And then there is a little note here that says Sorry to inform you that the special wax seal item is lost within the USPS system and we did not want to hold up your box. The item cannot be replaced due to it being handmade. And I apologize for the missing item, Erica. So there were some wax um, 
seals. If you saw my unboxing of Be Goods, then you've seen what the wax seals are. I think that they were, for this box, were made by um, Teal's Gold. So here are some journaling cards. I need to do that more often, just like sit in the tub and relax with a book and a drink. You must learn to trust that there is a future waiting for you that is beyond what you might be able to grasp at this moment. Got the center yourself daily and the take care of you. So these are, except for this one, these are all blank on the back. This one's um, the menu card of what's included. So we've got stickers. So this is considered a bookmark, by the way. Um, so we've had our stickers, our pin, our bookmark, our adhesive pockets, and then the four journaling cards, and then we have seven sticker sheets. So this first sticker sheet is deeply rooted full boxes and journal prompts. So you've got nine full boxes there. And then the deeply rooted peace of mind, which I like the, I think they call it line art. So there's that. Deeply rooted I feel. Deeply rooted Lily part two. That is my favorite. Deeply rooted Lily. So this is part one and part two. Center your spirit. And deeply rooted in my faith. And our star of the show is the Deeply Rooted Journal. Okay. So for this journal, I love this cover. So pretty. It says deeply rooted on the front. And then there's a place for you to say who the journal belongs to. And on the left side, we have a place for you to put your mood today, the date, your affirmation for the day, your intentions, spiritual goals for the day, journal talking points, what you will do today to manifest what you want, an intentional prayer, a word of the day, gratitude, and angel numbers. And then on the other side, it is grid paper, and it says at the top, let that pin flow, and then it repeats. And I don't know how many pages are in here, let's see, but... There are some breaks in between. So here is like a, I don't know if this is a month. Let's give it a quick count. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we had eight layouts and then there is a place for self-love quote of the day, date, mood, and some lines. And then there is a kind of like a divider dashboard here. Um, you must release the past to receive the present. And then you have that same layout again. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then again, self-love. It's not always easy to let go of your past due to the unhealed wounds. So I'm assuming it's going to continue to do to be the same number of pages. But I could be wrong. Oh, there we go. 
time to reflect, time to find ways to heal your past. You have to be what you needed the whole time to let go of the strongholds over your journey. I'm really looking forward to using this. It's time to tap into yourself. Allow your unhealed wounds to teach you forgiveness, how to love yourself, and how to protect your peace of mind. Enjoy the peace and silence of healed wounds. New understandings bring new visions. It's time to shine your light. It's time to speak your truth. It's time to do what you want to do with your journey. You are strong. Show us your strength. Make the decisions for your life that will result in joy and peace for you. Speak life over yourself. Rest. I need that reminder all the time. Center yourself. Move in silence. I think. Your power is in the present. And then after this one, it's all um, graph grid paper to the end. The end has this cover which says deeply rooted in my spiritual walk, which I might go through here and cut. So I can flip this back. I don't have to cut this one. I like the deeply rooted, but I would really like to make this my front cover. Let me just go ahead and do it on camera so y'all can yell at me while I'm doing it. I need support. So, um, what do you think of this set box? I always love Isisella Jewels products. I've never been disappointed. And I am pretty excited about this journal. I don't know if I always buy a journal for um, every year for, and I always pick up devotional every year. So when I saw that this one was going to be included in the box um, that solved the problem for me but I always like to have it ready to go on the first day of the month because when I don't it stresses me out and uh, and I checked the mailbox yesterday my life would have been a lot simpler this morning but that's okay we gonna catch up and be good to go did you know that you could make a cover <laughs> removable I'm sure you all already knew that but there we go. New cover. This is how we do. Yay! Okay, so I'm going to do my planner lineup video, and I'll probably have that for you this weekend. I had moved it to next weekend just because I wasn't sure um, when this would arrive. I still have to figure out the whole business social media planner thing, but I got some ideas. Um, so I can't wait to share with you all the planners that I'm using for 2022. I am pretty excited about this one, and um, this is probably one that as I get into it, not likely to um, share, but we shall see. I might occasionally share. So, Let me know what your thoughts are on the box. I am pretty excited, like I said, about the planner, the stickers. Um, all of it and I'm going to put it all to good use. So don't forget to like and subscribe. 
and let me know your favorite thing down in the comments, and I will see you next time. Bye!